so it looks like we found the location where we need to start this new mission. Let's head to the old abandoned schoolhouse. The Look beneath the stingers. Wait, wait, no! What does it say? I think it's telling us that we need to be nimble and quick and climb up there with this rope. Oh no, look! Ow, ow, ow! Ah, get off! So the hornets just stung me really bad. You guys see that red mark right there? That's where the hornet stung me. I gotta go back there though, you guys. I gotta get that jack-o'-lantern. Ooh, that really hurt. Ah! Comment down below if you guys have ever gotten stung by a hornet. Okay, all right. Oh, look! This is it right here. This is what was making the noise, Axel. It's some kind of crazy device, you guys. Look at that, some kind of chip. Here, I'm gonna throw it down. You get it. It has two eyes on it. Okay, you guys, now I'm gonna get a jackal here. I gotta be careful because these hornets, you guys, if they sting me too much, I could get crazy and fall off of here. I can't do that. I gotta be careful. That's a really long fall. Okay, are you ready, bro? the pumpkin you see it is there anything inside of it yep a note there's a note Axel said there's a note in the pumpkin I gotta find a way down oh how am I gonna get down it's a really long drop should I jump down you guys this is so far I don't know if I want to jump down it's like a 20 foot drop it's kind of dangerous actually I don't think I should do it what do you guys think comment down below should I jump down here that's a really long drop okay guys I think I'm gonna jump down I gotta get out on this ledge right here Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Oh, that hurt. Well, the note, what does it say? Open it up and read it. Trick or treat, I'll make it sweet. Get me down, I have no feet. What? Yeah. Dude, Axel already figured it out, you guys. You're right. Trick or treat, make it sweet. Get me down, I have no feet. That's this pumpkin right here. Look, it's got hands right there, but it has no feet. But how are we going to get it down? Look, there's a string attached right there. You think you can get that string down, Axel? Yeah. Okay, guys, Axel's going to climb up here. Okay, so get up there. You got it? I got it. You got it? It's not falling He got down. it. He got it, you guys. It's no. still not falling down. It here, come down. It must be. Come on down here. We'll try to pull it down. Maybe it's just stuck. <laughs> nice work, Agent Pikachu. Let's see if I can pull it. I'm going to jump up it. Oh! That is so pretty. Oh my gosh, look at these hands. Wow. Oh. Whoa. I, I pressed the press button. <laughs> that is so creepy. There's something in there. There's what? Something There's something in, in there. his mouth? I'm not sticking my hand in there. What? <laughs> okay, Axel's brave. I'm like, I'm not sticking my hand in there. <laughs> to bite you. It looks like another note, you guys. See this right here? Axel pressed this. This is like a Halloween decoration, you guys. Lollipops? What? Lollipops? Oh, trick or treat, make it sweet. Yeah. You guys, lollipops. Wait. That is so cool. Bag of bones, no skin or hair. Home of birds, you'll find me there. Bag of bones. Home of birds. No skin I or hair. I see the birdhouse. There's birds. Let me have one of the lollipops. You know what, you guys? We need to think really quickly on our feet right now. And sugar, it actually hurts your ability to think on your feet. I don't know if you guys know that, but you agents, if you're ever in like a secret mission, don't eat a bunch of sugar because it'll really mess with your brain. It's not good for you. You can have sugar later another time. You gotta stay focused when you're on missions. So let's uh, keep these stashed in our pumpkin face here. What do you eat them? That dude is so creepy. Let's hear that again. You hear that, you guys? And you push this right here. That is so creepy. He says, come closer. <laughs> okay, on to the next clue. Bag of bones, no skin or hair. Home of birds, you'll find me there. Where do birds make their homes? Well, Axel, what are places birds make their homes, though? Up on ledges? Oh, look. Oh, look, there's a bird in a tree right now. 
That's a rooster. You guys, it's a rooster, and it just flew up on the roof and ran away. That's hilarious. There was a rooster in the tree. Okay, so trees. Birds make their homes in trees. Bag of bones, no skin or hair. Bones don't have skin or hair. Oh wait, a skeleton. A skeleton they sometimes refer to as a bag of bones. Dry bones. <laughs> dry bones, yeah, dry bones on Mario Kart. He's a skeleton. Uh, Maybe they mean a nice oh, th huge there's a tree. Oh yes, yes, Axel's right, you guys. This is the huge tree that we saw earlier. This is the massive one. This thing is so big. Look, this thing, what? A dinosaur. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's a dinosaur skeleton up in that tree. What? Okay, this is getting really weird, you guys. Do you see that? That is so weird. What are we gonna do? You climb up there. Throw your it? sword at it. Try to throw your sword at it. Ah, oh, we missed. We need to get up there, Axel. I bet the next clue is with that. When I was over there, and uh -huh. you left me just a tiny bit ago, its eyes glowed dark red, uh -huh. and it looked at me. What? Yeah. You guys, that's so creepy. I went to go get the GoPro, and Axel said the dinosaur skeleton's head turned and looked at Axel. Look, that's a perfect way to get up. There yes, you're right. The Axel's right, you guys. This is a perfect way to get up. Let's try to get up there, okay? Okay, you guys, so we're gonna climb up this tree and see if we can get that skeleton. Hold on, I'm coming up, okay? Mm -hmm. okay. I right. can see the skeleton. Look, it's right see it? Okay, you guys, so Axel doesn't want to climb out all the way along that branch. You're just gonna leave me to do this by myself? I'm gonna be right here. Agent Tex is going solo, you guys. This is really high up, you guys. I gotta be careful. There it is. I kind of creeped out, you guys. I don't know what to do here. I don't know if I should touch it or what. This is definitely looks like a triceratops skeleton. There's its jawbone right there. Whoa! Okay, I just activate it somehow by touching it, you guys. Look at that. It's staring straight at me, Daddy. Is it staring at you? This is really creepy, you guys. So I'm gonna try to knock it down. Okay, here it goes. Whoa, oh! Ow! It stopped, you guys. I think knocking it down stopped it from making all that noise. Okay. Oh, that's just we got a What? Okay, guys, I'm gonna jump down here. Oh! Oh, this, and we get a Sharpie! There's it? There's a Sharpie? Yes! Is that is? There's some kind of clue? Open up the Sharpie. Is there some kind of clue in it? Inside of the cap, maybe? Look inside the cap, you guys. No clue. Where did you find the Sharpie? Right there. Where? Oh, a map! Oh, yeah. you guys, there's another note right here. Oh, how do you get that out? It's right inside of the you know what, you guys. That's so weird. I don't care if we break it. I just want to get the note out. Right. Oh, I wonder if oh. it's stinky in there. Oh, well, I just popped the tail straight off. That's gross. <laughs> Ew. Oh, this is so weird. Wait a minute, nasty. I think I have it. You got it? it? Yeah. Okay, pull it out. It's still making noise, you guys. All right, so what does the next note say? Count my arches, all but one. Multiply them when you're done. Take the product, divide your age, check your work, and curve your page. Find That's quotient. quotient. Run a line, counting inches from the sign. Oh no, inches, you guys. That's what we needed the measuring tape for. Well, we're gonna have to see if we can figure it out without the measuring tape. So we're back here where we started. We got that pumpkin there, that pumpkin there, and we got the dinosaur skeleton. Count my arches, arches. Oh, you're right. All, All but one. Multiply them when you're done. Multiply them when you're done. So multiply the arches that we count minus one this is a math riddle, you guys. Mm. He told us he was trying to sharpen our brains. Some of you guys may mm. know about word problems and Maybe math Maybe we shouldn't count the wasp. Yeah, here? oh my gosh, those wasps up there. Oh, mm. see that whelp right there, you guys? That's where it stung me. Right here? Yeah, ow, ow, oh, that hurt. Okay, so let's count the arches. Come on over here, Axel. You guys count them with us, okay, to make sure we get our counting right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 19. So we counted 19 arches. Is that how many you counted? Comment down below and tell us how many you counted, okay? Count my arches all but one. 18. 18. Okay, multiply them. Okay, where's that Sharpie? What'd you do with the Sharpie, Axel? Okay, so we lost the Sharpie, so I had to go get another one that I had in my truck. Okay, adventurers, so we need your help, especially you secret agent adventurers, all right? I need you to comment down below with your secret agent name what you get whenever we're doing this. You guys help us do it. Pause the video and let us know what you get. Are you right? Count my arches all but one. So we figured out the arches all but one, 18. So multiply them when you're done. Multiply them by themselves. So that's Wait. 18 times 18. Let's try that. Go ahead and pause it. Write this down and see if you guys can solve the problem, okay? 
That's what's so fun. See if you guys can get the right answer, okay? Eight times eight is 64. One times eight is what? Eight. Plus six is what? 14. Yep. 100. We're gonna add zero right here to take the tens place. What's eight times one? Eight. What's one times one? One. One. We're gonna turn it into an addition problem. Four plus zero is four. Four plus eight is what? 12. 12. One, two, and what's one plus one plus one? Three. 324. 324 is the Three. product. Take the product, divide your age. What's your age? Nine. Okay, so we're gonna do a division problem here. So that's 324 divided by nine. Okay, nine goes into 32 three times. Three times nine is one. 27. Five left over, so we'll put a five right here. How many times does nine go into 54? Six. He's right. 36, find the quotient. Our quotient here from dividing is 36. Run a line counting inches from the sign. 36 inches maybe from the sign. Peace sign! Oh. From the peace sign! Yes, yes, okay. Axel just found a very important clue. We think they're talking about the peace sign. I haven't seen sign come up this whole time. It must mean the peace sign. Yeah. Okay, you guys, we gotta run 36 inches from the sign. We gotta hurry, you guys. It's getting dark here. Look, the moon's already out right there. It's getting kind of creepy here, you guys. There's the first peace sign we found right there, right? That one, and then the one that's covered up in the door. This is about six inches right here. So my foot is about six inches? Yeah, your foot's about six inches. So what times what is 36? Six sixes. Six sixes, okay. So step in front of your feet six times. Right? One, that's two, three. 18 inches, 24 inches. Four, um, five, 30 inches. six. Right there. There's nothing right there. Yeah, I don't see anything right here, you guys. This is solid cement there. All right, so maybe from this peace sign. It's all covered up though. Maybe from that peace sign. From that one over there? Let's go try this other peace sign. Come on, come on over here. Okay, so there's the peace sign right there. We need to start directly below Six it, inches. okay? Okay, right there. 12 inches. One. 18 inches. 18. And then. 24. 36. 30. Okay, we are 36 inches from the peace sign. Right one, okay. 30, there's a sort of small hole right there. All right, so we're gonna dig in the dirt. It's getting dark, you guys. It's so dark here. There's something right there. Yeah, that's, that's. Oh my gosh, there is something. That's something. You guys, there's something right here. It's a face, it's a face. It's, it's a face? It's a skeleton. What? Look at that. A skeleton? Dig it out, dig it out. Look, you see the eye part right there? It does look like it. That's an eye. <gasps> oh my gosh, keep digging, keep digging. Keep digging. Oh, there's teeth. This is so creepy, you guys. Look at that. It's a face looking at us from the earth. Is it moving? Oh, I'm doing that. Okay. Oh, it came out. It's just a piece it's of wood. It's a box. Wood. You guys, it's a box. Oh my gosh, that's so sad. It's so creepy. I think creepy. I see something. Okay. Come Wait, apart. push this side. It moves a little bit. It looks like it slides. It looks like some kind of puzzle. Oh, that part. You have to take that out. Uh, oh, you're right. Look. It looks like you have to take that out, but it's mm -hmm. stuck. We need to get out of here, Axel. This is starting to be really creepy. All this creepy stuff, the jack o and the pumpkin guy, this skull, the skeleton, you guys, the dinosaur skeleton, it's so creepy here. I wanna get out of here. Nothing to worry about. Oh! Get in, Axel! Get in! Get in! Get the pumpkin creeper! Get it! What is up, adventurers? We are back here. It's the next day. It was getting so dark and so creepy here, we did not feel safe, so we came back and we have this skull. We don't know what's in here yet, right? We haven't opened it yet. We wanted to wait for you guys because it might be another clue that leads us to something else, which I is hope, why we came back and we didn't open it home. It's at least a $1 bill and two more maps. But what how are we gonna get it open? This thing is really, really cool and I, I don't wanna it. break it. Just comment down below how you think we should open it. Looks like this is like a piece right here. It's like a bone and you pull this out Wait, and then maybe this? you can slide this because this slides, see that? That slides back and forth. Some kind of puzzle. Are you gonna oh. use the sword or the screwdriver? I'm gonna try the sword. Okay, we're gonna try to pry it open with the ninja sword here. Maybe we can use this flat in the screwdriver. You wanna try that? Yeah. Okay, guys, so we're gonna use a screwdriver to try to get this thing open. Ah, I'm trying to wedge it in there. Ah, man, it's just stuck tight. Oh, okay, you guys, so it slid open. See if you can pull it out. Oh my gosh, it's coming out. Oh, it came out, you guys. Oh, look at that, it just slid right off. Oh my gosh, whoa. Look at this. What is that? I've seen this before. It's a shark tooth. A shark tooth? Yes. Hold on, let me see. Yeah. You guys, what is this? No, a fishing hook. It looks like a fishing hook, yeah. It's you guys, it. this is some kind of like necklace. It looks like a fish hook. Okay, you guys, there's also another note in here. 
What does it say? What well it say? done, agents. You have proved that you are ready for your next mission. I will be contacting you. First clue is the necklace you found in the skull puzzle. Study and learn as much about it as you can. Ask the viewer agents to do the same. You will need all the help you can get on this mission. The real game master. It looks like we've completed this mission here at the old abandoned schoolhouse. And the real game master told us to ask you guys to study up on this and see if you can figure out what it is. Comment down below, do any of you guys know what this is right here? What is this? It looks really, really cool. All right, adventurers, well, remember, we love you, we think you're so awesome, and we're so glad that you could join us for today's epic adventure. You guys get out and use your imaginations to find creative ways to live your life and love everyone around you. No matter what you have, no matter where you are, you can have fun and enjoy your life, just like you see us doing every day if you just use your imagination. I actually got hooked. <laughs> Do as much research as you possibly can to figure out what that is. We're gonna do some research and we'll let you know what we find on the next episode.